thinking their plans to betray the royal family negatively in their upcoming projects with Netflix and Prince Harry memoir. However, it looks like the couple is backpedaling after the death of Queen Elizabeth. After the Queen died, Harry and Meghan witnessed the global love and support extended to the royal family. Because of this, Harry and Meghan now understand that they have to thread softly in their promised salacious details about the royal family. It is rumored that they are changing portions of their projects to focus less on the negative facts surrounding King Charles and Queen Camilla, and focus more on the rich legacy Queen Elizabeth left behind. According to sources, Meghan and Harry will reveal details about their time in the royal family but they will try to avoid revealing intimate details about the main royals, his father, King Charles, his stepmother Queen Camilla, his brother, Prince William, and sister-in-law, Princess Catherine. In 2020 Meghan and Harry stepped back from royal duties. It was this same time that the couple signed a mega deal with Netflix. The goals of these deals were to create partnership with Netflix to create contents like documentaries, movies, and children's programming. The couple is set to release a docuseries, and Harry is preparing to release his memoir. Since the death of the monarch it appears that Harry is having second thoughts about betraying his family and is now attempting to make changes to the contents of his memoir and the docuseries. Regardless of the negative press that surround Meghan and Harry they are pressing ahead with their million dollar projects. It is alleged that Meghan moved to America to have a voice and she feels it's important for Harry to speak up about matters close to his heart, including his family. It is clear that the royal family is anxiously awaiting the revelations from Harry's memoir and the docuseries. Tensions remain high between Harry and the royals. If Harry's prior interview are any indicator the royal family should be worried because in March 2021, Harry gave an interview and alleged that his father stopped taking his telephone calls. He also claimed that his father cut him off financially after he moved to California. In this interview Harry talked about the pain his father faced during his marriage and divorce from the late Princess Diana and because of this experience his father should have been more supportive of his actions. He claimed he will always love his father, but admitted that there is a lot of hurt to overcome. King Charles is trying to maintain a cordial relationship with Harry and Meghan but this is going to be difficult because Meghan is from a fractured family and she appears to be encouraging Harry to distance himself from his family. If there is any doubt about Meghan toxicity and selfish behavior, Remember the day of her wedding the only recognized family member in attendance was her mother. The olive branch will work if Meghan and Harry recognize the error of their behavior and apologize to the royal family for spreading lies about the family.